There's talk of a third party, Bill Kristol and Mitt Romney are trying to put one together. Should they stop that? Well, I, I don't. I, I, I've, I've heard that Mitt actually isn't looking at that. I, I'm not sure about Bill Crystal, but it's a it's a suicide mission because you're not only changing and throwing out eight years of the White House, but you're also throwing out potentially generations in the Supreme Court. Look, we could have up to three justices change over in the next eight years, and and this is a suicide mission. It is it is not right. And um, I think what people should do is take the Paul Ryan approach, which is to work with Donald Trump and find out whether or not there's common ground and whether there can be assurances on the Supreme Court and those sorts of things to make sure that our future is secure uh, down the line as opposed to blowing everything up. Let me ask you about Paul Ryan. He differs with Mr. Trump on the issues of immigration, entitlements, taxes, trade. Three times during the campaign, he came out and questioned his tone on issues from the Muslim ban on immigration to uh, his reluctance to denounce white supremacists. So what's the basis for unity between the two of them? Well, look, I think they, they agree on far more than they disagree on. I mean, they agree on uh, various agenda items in Paul Ryan's agenda. They agree on the Supreme Court. Um, they agree on the platform of the Republican Party. They agree on abortion. I mean, look, I, I, I think you've got about 80 percent overlap. And, and, and you've seen actually Donald Trump this week uh, nuance a little bit on some of those positions that you've just outlined. And so I think we're going to get there. I think there's plenty of common ground. And when the choice is Hillary Clinton and when someone who's made a career of lying and, and, and skirting the issues, and, and you look at the, the emails, the Benghazi, the Clinton Foundation, um, and a guy who's never run for office and might have some stories out there that, that you know, make, make some interesting news. I think in the end, people are going to choose the person that's going to cause an earthquake in Washington and get something done over Hillary Clinton. All right, Chairman Reince Priebus, thanks so much for being with us. You bet, John.